I am a student in this US history course. I'm going to go to my grades section and here I can see my current grade. So right here, this is 70.75% a C plus. Now, this grade is showing me my grades based on what the teacher has graded. So if you look at this first assignment right here, test one, two, three, it has a dash. This dash means that it has not yet been graded. So this is not a part of my current grade. It's not reflected up here in this C plus grade. And that is because this box right here is checked and this is checked by default. This is saying that it's calculating my grade, the total grade up here, based only on assignments that have been graded by the teacher. So this one here with the dash, these guys here have not yet been graded, so they are not shown or reflected in this total grade. Only the grades that have an actual grade, like this one of 15 out of 20, or a six and a half out of 10, or a one out of 20, only those grades are being calculated up here in my total. If I were to uncheck this box, what it is doing is it is now showing all of these as zeros. So it's calculating even the ones that have not yet been graded by a teacher, but it's giving them the score of a zero. So it brought my grade down to a 31%. So by default, this is checked, and this is your current grade. When a teacher goes in and grades one of these assignments, then that will be reflected up here. So this is the grade you want to look at. If you uncheck this, this is like your worst case scenario if you got a zero on all of the assignments that have not yet been graded. Now there is something else that you can do here in Canvas. You can view your grades based on what if scores. So you can say like what would have happened had I got a 20 out of 20. So my grade would go from a 70% to a 74%. I can look at these ungraded test scores or ungraded scores and I can say, well, what would happen if I got a 15 out of 20 on that? What would my grade be? And so now when it's showing this, it says, note, this is not your official score because I have these grades that are my what if grades. So I'm going to revert to the actual score by clicking on this box right here or I can click on the arrows right here and it will bring everything back and you can see that that note is now gone so this is my actual current grade in the class now one thing to think about is if you are looking at your scores for eligibility for sports for example a lot of times the quarters they always end on a Friday and a lot of times students will go and look at their grade on that Friday however teachers have until normally the Tuesday or the Wednesday of the following week to get their grade submitted. So when you look at your grade on a Friday at the end of the quarter, it may change as the teacher is grading and updating things over the weekend up until the day that grades are due. So your grade may change if a teacher goes in and adds things because the grades are due for teachers to submit after the end date of the quarter. So keep that in mind.